you've been in here like fucking relaxing. I've been doing shit. There's this whole woman called Lisa that you don't even know about. It was, it was insane. She raped me, and she she was a motherfucker. It, I tell you, on the flight out of here, it is crazy. There's some crazy shit been going on in this place. I tell you. Not normal shit either. Let's get going. Yeah, you go ahead. I'm gonna hang back for a moment for no reason. Let's get going. It'll be safer if we split up for this last little section. So many doors. And stairs as well for that matter. Here's some more stairs for the people that love stairs. Quite surprised nothing's decided to respawn. That's actually quite a nice little walk back. Oh shit. All personnel must be back There we go. Need a space free, so self-destruct system has been activated. This is gonna be close. No, see, I can't hit that. Oh, hang on, I didn't need to hit the battery. Up. Oh, what? You got somewhere better to be, Brad? Huh? Gotta get home or some shit? Gotta go see the latest episode of uh, Breaking Bad? No, I don't want that. How far am I? The elevator back should be at the end. Inconvenient. Needlessly long corridor. Is that it? Is that the battery? The self-destruct system has been activated. All personnel fuse unit. Yeah, I'll pick it up, Jill. Don't you worry. Even though you can carry eight spaces, you selfish bitch. Eight spaces which you haven't needed. Detonation. The self-destruct system's activated. Good no work. shit. Brad's up in the helicopter. Those things are coming. I'll take care of them. But Chris, you just get in contact with Brad somehow. Okay. You mean you two actually want to do some work for a change? Fuck. Warning. <laughs> I didn't get to where I am today by reading signs. I'm going up anyway. Oh, a timer. Could it be any more dramatic? Mr. Vickers, get your ass down here now. So it's going to be the 4th of July up in here. Or up out here, we're outside now. Chris! Hey, okay. it's a family yeah. reunion. Oh, and there's one member missing, and here he comes. Alright, guys. You. 
Oh yeah, use your handguns. That's because that's really gonna help. What's Chris doing? Just watch it. Though. Well, I bet he's gonna fuck Rebecca up now. Throw the gun at him. Shit. Ow! Fuck me! <coughs> that was rude. Ah, shit. All right, Tyrant. Let's do this. Fuck it, man. I could try and run out of the way, but I'm standing on the ground like shit. Well, oh, that's why. I'm hacking them out of ammo. Oh, you dick! Listen, mate. I can appreciate where you're coming from. You do need to learn some manners. Where the fuck is Brad? Thank you. Chris, use it. Kill it, whatever it is. <laughs> yeah, it's the end boss, mate. Thanks for the rocket launcher. He's gonna smack me in the fucking face now. Great. Look, mate. This playthrough has gone on long enough. Goodbye, you test tube freak. Yeah! So, the disc, like, totally ran out on me. But thanks to my skillful editing, you probably wouldn't have even noticed. You wouldn't even know about it, except for the fact that I just told you. Needlessly. But, there we go. Saw it coming, really. So, in typical Resident Evil fashion, we leave in a helicopter. Oh shit, I left my car keys! Oh, damn! She's asleep and I did all the work. And away we go into the sunset. See, couldn't the disc have just held out a little bit longer? Now I'm using a second disc. The game you've been playing is Resident Evil. Well, guys, ooh, <laughs> thank you very much for watching this playthrough. I once again would like to say sorry that it's taken so long to um, have finished it. But as you know, things happened and uh, everything got really complicated for a while and I had to move. Um, so yeah, obviously that delayed everything. But for those of you that have, thank you very much for sticking with me and sticking with this playthrough. I, you know, like I said, I really hope you enjoyed it. Uh, it's, um, been kind of like a what like like a homecoming I guess you could say for me in a way I mean I've nearly been on YouTube for three years now well I mean, it might even be three years by the time this is uh, uploaded this last part but at the current time I've nearly been on YouTube for three years and I did in my first year of uh, let's play shall we say I did Resident Evil the PS1 version as Jill um, though it wasn't my first ever playthrough, it was my first full survival horror playthrough. So it's been nice to come back to this one. Uh, my first playthrough I did was uh, MGS, and uh, then Saints Row 2, and I did do Lost in Nightmares, but Resident Evil 1 for the PS1 was my first survival horror uh, playthrough that I recorded. And so it kind of started it all, because obviously I mainly do survival horrors now, <laughs> as you probably can tell. So yeah, it was nice to play this basically. Uh, as for what's coming next, I've got several games that I want to do. I plan to start more than one playthrough. I may have already started another playthrough uh, at the time of this being uploaded, but there are so many, so many games that I want to do, uh, which I'll talk about in a moment. 
Six hours yes. thirty. Yes. Fucking hell. That's got to be a bad time, right? It'd be a bad time for the PS1 version. Oh well, I don't care. A headphone. You can now play Real Survivor Mode. The Real Survival Mode has been unlocked. In this mode, the item boxes are no longer linked. The items put in the item box can only be retrieved from that location. In addition, aiming changes to manual operation. This is the prototype feature that existed even before the first Resident Evil game. Fancy! Chris has a new costume. You got the closet key. A uh, new costume has been unlocked. You can change your outfit in the costume room. Ooh. Sounds like fun. And then let's save another time. Okay. Ooh, the backdrop's changed. <laughs> right. Okay, well, I'll just use this time quickly to uh, just update things about the future of the channel. Um, well, there is loads of uh, games that I want to do. I've got a few games in mind for what I want to do next. Obviously, I don't want to give anything away. But there's plenty of games that I want to do. I just want to reel off a few games that are on their way soonish that people ask me about. Uh, yes, Rule of Rose is um, on the way. Fatal Frame is on the way. I plan to do all three of the Fatal Frames. Silent Hill Shattered Memories, Silent Hill Origins, Silent Hill 4, Resident Evil Co. Veronica, uh, Dead Rising 2, Dead Rising 2 off the record. All these games are on the way. Also some old school games that I want to do. I want to do Fear Effect 1, Fear Effect 2. Uh, I was even looking, thinking of doing Little Big Adventure the other day. I don't know how many people remember that game. Uh, maybe even Broken Sword. Basically, there's loads of games that I've got in my head right now. I haven't got my mind set on one in particular. By the time this is uploaded, I would have hoped I've uh, recorded something ready to go. Oh, there's also another game that I stumbled across the other day, which is quite rare. And I looked up on YouTube to see if there's any Let's Plays done of it. And there wasn't. It's not a great game, but it's kind of like Overblood in a way. It's one of these, like, I think it'd make a good uh, playthrough, even though it's not a good game. And since there's not really one on YouTube, I think that there was like one, but it wasn't finished. Um, I may do it, but we'll see. But anyway, guys, um, thank you again for sticking with me, and I hope you enjoyed this playthrough. And I will see you in the next video. Cheers, guys.